This is Janet Shamlian in Houston, where demand is overwhelming COVID testing sites, even spilling out onto a nearby freeway, an hours-long wait. People recognize the importance of testing. It is better to know than not to know. It's now filtering down to small emergency clinics, which can't find nearby hospital beds. We are having to send patients 50, 60 miles far away just to get them a bed. Can you compare this to anything you've dealt with before medically? Never. Cases are surging throughout Texas amid reopening and mixed messages on mask wearing. We encourage uh, everyone to wear a mask uh, in the affected areas. The vice president wore one in a Dallas church Sunday. Jesus saves. But the 100 plus member choir belted out hymns without them. New York's governor says the president should take action. And then let the president lead by example and let the president put a mask on it. From anger at a California grocery store. Anyone harassing me to wear a mask, you guys are violating federal law. To indifference in Boston. I just personally don't care. Yeah, why is yeah. that? Uh, I haven't got sick yet, so. In Texas, the governor has ordered restaurants to return to 50% capacity. Houston's Boss Cat Kitchen decided to shut down completely. I've been through uh, hurricanes, uh, tornadoes, economic downturn. This is a completely different animal because there's, there's, there's no answer to it. The lines for testing are growing here. And tonight there's concern about what happens when school reopens. In one Texas district, 73% of parents said if cases keep growing, they will keep their children home. Major? Janet Shamley, and thank you.